Okay, hello, it's Brooke Hoover. Hey, I'm trying to uh, play along with uh, my E Blues Jam track at 58 beats a minute. I'm going to play some chord tone soloing. I'm going to just outline the chords kind of uh, subtly. I'm not going to, you know, get too crazy. I'm just going to kind of make really basic phrases like for an E. And like A will be just hitting the root and there's the root of E, the B, <laughs> A, and the E and the B, B. <laughs> so, uh, I'm just going to kind of keep it simple here, okay? And then, I, I, you know, for the first couple times, and then I might uh, sort of sneak out into something else. You know, let's just see what happens. Keep it loose. So here's 58 beats a minute. I'm going to play my video of me playing uh, the same guitar with the metronome. And you'll be able to hear it, hopefully. Oh, exciting. <laughs> <laughs> comes the first phrase. E. E. Now I'm going to A. Now I'm going to hit like some thirds. It's a G sharp. The third of A is C sharp. G sharp. There's a high one. Now the third of B is D sharp. C sharp. G sharp. Yeah. Pause that. All right. Good. <laughs> Hopefully that wasn't too weird. So I was, again, just doing... Kind of your typical, most bare bones, basic phrases, which sound really pretty good. Uh, you know, it's a little stiff. It's not what I would call a rip roaring solo, but I rarely even do that anyway, unless I'm doing surf zombie stuff. Then it gets a little crazy. But you know, I'm kind of reserved with my shredding. I don't know what the deal is. I just kind of want to be understated. But I like those kind of spare sparse, whatever the word is, <laughs> phrases. And they sound in tune where you don't have to work so hard and play super fast. You you know, I probably need to step it up. But okay, then I mentioned the thirds. The third of E is G sharp. The third of A is C sharp. And the third of B is D sharp. And those notes just sound great, you know. And in my thinking, it takes away the need to 
you know, accelerate and work so hard. <laughs> it's I can be lazy and just play uh, the thirds, and I sound, you know, kind of a little more, uh, I sound in tune with the chords, or I don't have to, you know, punish myself by uh, shredding. I don't know, I'm lazy. <laughs> but the thirds work so well that I probably need to learn some new solos, but uh, still, if you're not used to that, this is pretty cool. All right, so let me know what you think, and uh, we can do more of this if you like it. All right, thanks for the idea about chord tone soloing in E. Thanks a lot.